What's happening? It's Shane here, and today we're going to be talking about the most meaningful degrees. This is going to be an updated list for 2021, right? So these are going to be the exact degrees that when people get them, they end up in jobs that give them a lot of meaning. And meaning basically means that they think their job is positively impacting the world. And this is a big component to your job satisfaction and your overall happiness with your career. And some of these are going to be bachelor level degrees, master's degrees, as well as doctoral degrees. And I'm hoping this video will help you choose the degree that you want to get and go into the career that is the best for you. But before we get into it, make sure to gently tap that like button, hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so that you never miss out on a video. Number nine on this list is going to be the cardiopulmonary science. And this is basically the science that has to do with the cardiac system, which is your veins, arteries, and your heart, as well as your lungs. This one has an 89% meaning score. And by the way, this is data from Payscale. And to put that in perspective, the degree with the lowest meaning score is Japanese studies at 21%, right? So it might be something you're interested in. Obviously, a lot of people would be interested in Japanese studies. However, it doesn't necessarily positively impact the world, right? So you're not directly helping other people with your career and therefore it has less meaning, right? So I might enjoy video games, but that doesn't necessarily mean that I'm helping the rest of the world when I destroy 12 year olds and make them rage on Call of Duty. Now, on top of that, uh, cardiopulmonary science, you can expect to make $45,800 a year starting out and $72,600 in mid-career pay. So not bad. Next one on the list is going to be cytotechnology. So this is basically going to be where you look at cells under a microscope with the specific intent, at least usually, of detecting cancer. This one has a 90% meaning score and you can expect to make $58,000 a year starting out and $76,000 in mid career pay. So both of these are kind of health slash science related degrees so far. And the next one is also going to be a health degree, but it's kind of mixed with technology and that's going to be cardiovascular technology. This one has a meaning score of 90%. You can expect to make around $56,000 a year starting out and 72,000 in mid career pay. So cardiovascular technology might be something like a heart monitor. And you can definitely see why this one would have very high meaning score. You're definitely helping people out if they have heart issues. Next one on the list is yet another healthcare related degree. Big surprise, physical therapy. Now this one is usually going to be either a master's or a doctoral level degree, but it has a 90% meaning score. You're going to start off with around 53,000 in pay early on in your career, and then mid-career pay is 93,000. And this one, as well as the next one on the list, which is occupational therapy, are very similar. Now with occupational therapy, it also has a 90% meaning score. On top of that, you're gonna make around $55,000 a year starting out. And the mid-career pay is gonna be about 89,000. This is another one where generally it's gonna be either a master's or a doctoral level degree. Now, one great thing about physical therapy and occupational therapy and I know this because I've worked closely with them and I also know people who are physical therapists, is that you basically get to work with people and you see them in the state where maybe they just got injured, something along those lines, and then you work with them all the way through until they make a recovery. Right. So other types of healthcare, you're helping people just as much, but you might not get to see them get better. Right. So you might not actually get to see the fruits of your labors. So as a nurse or a doctor, for instance, you know, someone comes in, they've got, you know, something wrong with them. Uh, you take care of them. Uh, at that time and then maybe you refer them to a different doctor, right? So you never really know what happened to them. But with physical therapy and occupational therapy, it can be very rewarding because you get to kind of see them all through that process. Now the next one on the list can be very tough on certain people, but if you have very thick skin, it can be a good option for you and that is going to be radiation therapy. It has a 91% meaning score and this is one that you can actually get into sort of at the associate or bachelor level. Uh, depending on the state you live in, it's going to take somewhere between two to four years. And you're going to start off making around $65,000 a year and $89,000 in mid-career pay. Next one on the list is going to be diagnostic medical ultrasound. Very similar to sonography if you're familiar with that. 
And this is another one where depending on the state you can live in, you can actually get into it with just a few years. So two to four years. Now this one also has a 91% meaning score. And on top of that, you can start off making around $53,000 a year and 77,000 in mid-career pay. I think these two also have in common with uh, you know occupational and physical therapy that you keep seeing the same people over and over again, right? So you see them when they first come in, they've got some kind of medical problem and then you take care of them for maybe several months or even up to like a several years in some cases and then you get to see them out until you know the problem gets solved and so that can be extremely rewarding and unfortunately some types of healthcare you don't really get that and so I think that probably is the main reason why it has such a high meaning score now with radiation therapy specifically you're going to be working with people most of the time who have cancer right so that can be a very tough job uh, hopefully you're not the type of person who brings it home with you Hopefully you can kind of just block things off and you also have thick skin, but for the right type of person, extremely rewarding. Next one on the list, the last one is going to be alcohol and drug studies. This one has a 93% meaning score, the highest on the entire list. Now, doesn't pay nearly as well as a lot of the other ones. Starts off around $35,000 a year and mid-career pay is 48,000. But again, the types of jobs you would go into would be the types of jobs where you work with someone uh, for a long period of time. You know, they're probably an alcoholic or they're addicted to drugs and you would help them all through the process of getting clean. So what did we learn here? Tons of health related careers when it comes to meaningful degrees and meaningful careers. Pretty much every single one on this list was health related. So this is one of the many reasons why health careers, health degrees are so highly sought out. There are a lot of positives, perks, and benefits to getting into a healthcare related career. Hope you enjoyed this video. Check out my other ones right here. I made them just for you. Go ahead. Gently tap the like button, hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and comment down below any thoughts, comments, criticisms, etc. that you have on the video, and I will see you next time.